So what you be saying about me behind my back when you be mad? When I make you mad? Just tell me. You gonna whoop me? No, I'm not gonna whoop you. I promise. What you be saying? <laughs> I be saying, this motherfucking bitch be asking me questions. <laughs> 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 well, there you go. What's going on, party people? What is going on? It's your ride share extraordinaire, your super duper Uber drivers here, guys. That's right. Thank you. Thank you. You guys, you already know the deal. Before you hop in my ride, do me a favor. Hit the like. Hit that subscribe. Poor favor. <laughs> Come on, let's do this. Hop on in. Buckle in. And let's go. Okay, okay, party people, welcome back. And if you're new to my channel, thank you for hitting that subscribe button. All right, folks, what are we talking about today, folks? Man, oh man. I seen this news article um USA Today, the Democrat rag. Everybody know they're far leaning to the left. And they got an article here that is begging that is pleading Biden to do us a favor, do the whole nation a favor. You beat Trump before. Why don't you step down? And that's the only way you can beat him again. <laughs> what? I thought uh, Biden was doing a great job. He got the unemployment numbers down. He has inflation down. He has uh, gas prices down. <laughs> you have Hamas under control, the borders under control, all of this, all is a success, and they want him to step down and let somebody else be the front runner. And I'm like, how does what world is this? What is this? Why y'all want to do that? You know, and if y'all don't believe he could do it, although y'all been saying he's the greatest, and now y'all trying to say he got an age problem. We know it's not about the age because Trump is the same age as Biden, almost, give or take. But it's all about your mental capacity. And we see that Trump is leading leaps and bounds compared to Biden. But so they try to make a case and having Biden to be a hero and save our democracy. Step down and let somebody else be the front runner. And I want to know who is going to be the front runner. Because before, y'all said only Biden could beat Trump. And what we happened in 2020, we all know he had some help, right? So now it's 2024. Y'all said Biden is the only one that could beat Trump. But now y'all want him to step down and let somebody be the front runner. So who is going to be? Can I make a suggestion? <laughs> let's say let's get a woman a woman of color a woman that's pro lgbtqisuv right she's pro sex workers why don't you put kamala harris as a front runner that i went home one day and i said well what's why are conservatives bad mommy because i thought we were supposed to conserve things <laughs> <laughs> I couldn't reconcile it. Now I can. <laughs> she's She's been in the job long enough. She knows the in and outs of the White House, right? She's good with the women. She get all the women vote, right? Woo! So I put Kamala Harris as a front runner. Hmm? No? What about Ila Omar? The, uh, the representative out of Minnesota. She's a good representative of uh Palestine, right? How many more killings is enough for you? Is it a thousand more? Two thousand more? Three thousand? How many more Palestinians would make you happy if they died? Do you, are you, will you be fine if all of the people of Gaza were gone? Would that make you happy? Would that be the thing that makes you proud? And maybe that's the question you should ask 
Richie. Is he okay? How many more Palestinian lives is he comfortable with? She's fiery. She could beat Trump. Her poll numbers is better than Trump, right? What about Newsom Gruesome from California, that governor there? See what the great job he's doing with the homeless situation over there? Why did you put him as a front runner? I'm sorry, Governor. I didn't hear responses to either of those questions um, about whether uh, this is state money. Ultimately, I understand it goes to the counties. But do you acknowledge whether the money that the that the state isn't doing enough to ensure that the money is being well spent? I also didn't hear a response to whether you think that there is any I mean, is the public appetite? Do you think I'm hearing this like souring towards putting more money into the crisis? I didn't hear responses to either of those. Well, uh, and, and forgive me, I'll, I'll, I'll I'll, uh, if I appear to repeat the first spot. So the audit did not surprise me. What about Michelle Obama? Michelle Obama is popular. I mean, her books are flying off shelves. She could go to Target and she get mobbed by people because she's so popular. Why don't you put Michelle Obama as a front runner? Let me tell you something. For the first time in my adult lifetime, I'm really proud of my country because we know biden biden has done enough right all is the compliments i said that he's done y'all want to remove him and put somebody else so he can save democracy there are some pretty stark numbers that you're facing 76 percent of voters say they have real concerns about president biden's ability to serve a second term do you think it's responsible for Democrats to put him at the top of the ticket, given those concerns? Responsible. I revere his record. I, I mean, this, what he's done in three years has been a master class, close to 15 million jobs. That's eight times more than the last three Republican presidents combined. The economy is booming. Inflation is cooling. It's 0.6 percent more than it was in the summer of 2020 at just 3.1 percent. Wait a second. We have American manufacturing coming back home all because of Biden's wisdom, because of his temperance, his yeah. capacity to lead in a bipartisan manner, which is an underrepresented point. And so I have great confidence moving forward. So the answer is absolutely all in in terms of the next four years, the, Joe Biden. These <laughs> Wow, unbelievable. Man, you people, boy, you Democrats, y'all don't know what you want. Y'all don't know what y'all want. What a bizarre world we live in. What a fucking world we live in. If you guys got any value out of my content, do me a favor. Hit the like. Hit that subscribe. You see that notification bell? Turn on that notification bell so you get my latest and greatest. Share this content with your best friends and tell your mama I said hi. All right, all right. Till next time, guys, I'll see you again. And all you lawyers, get your ass off my fucking...